Motorola Droid Turbo 2 Screen Repair, Teardown and Reassemble. Warning, you're performing this repair at your own risk. We claim no responsibility for any damages that might occur. To perform this DIY repair, you'll need a plastic triangle opening tool, nylon spudger, SIM card ejection tool, fine tip curved tweezers, precision knife set, premium 2mm red adhesive roll, multi-purpose heat gun, professional T4 Torx screwdriver. Power down your Droid Turbo 2 smartphone. Remove the SIM card and micro SD card tray. Use the heat gun to warm up the adhesive, securing the Droid Turbo 2 rear cover to the mid frame. With the precision knife, carefully create separation and insert a plastic triangle opening tool to start slicing through the adhesive. Take your time and apply additional heat as needed. The adhesive securing the cover is relatively mild. Once the pick sneaks into the seam, the cover can be peeled up. Remove the following 17 T4 Torx screws. Use the tweezers to remove the two plastic covers and then detach the connectors underneath. You can now easily separate the Droid Turbo 2 mid-frame. Remove the physical power and volume buttons from the side of the mid-frame. Pry the headphone jack up and out of the chassis. Remove the Droid Turbo 2 vibrator. Peel up the piece of captain tape. And then release the ZIF connector. Carefully peel up the Droid Turbo 2 dual LED flash cable and microphone. Use the spudger to pry the Droid Turbo 2 loudspeaker up from the plastic midframe. Remove the inductive charging coil. Turn the midframe over and remove the Motorola Droid Turbo 2 rear camera lens and flash bezel. Utilizing the tweezers, remove the dual LED flash.
Peel up the black tape. Remove the following two T4 Torx screws and then the bracket. Disconnect the Droid Turbo 2 battery from the motherboard. Use the sponger to detach and remove the 5 megapixel Droid Turbo 2 front facing selfie camera. Utilizing the tweezers, pry up the earpiece speaker. Disconnect the bevy of cables from the motherboard. With the cables detached, carefully free the Motorola Droid Turbo 2 motherboard from the display assembly. Release the ZIF connector and remove the IR sensor cable. Peel up the captain tape and release the ZIF connector. Easily pluck out the 21 megapixel Motorola Droid Turbo 2 rear-facing camera. With a little spudgering, the 3760 milliampere hour Droid Turbo 2 lithium-ion battery can be removed. Carefully peel up and remove the Droid Turbo 2 power and volume buttons flex cable. Peel up the display assembly cable. It is secured to the frame with relatively mild adhesive. Separate the plastic bezel from the frame.
Use the heat gun to warm up the adhesive securing the Motorola Droid Turbo 2 LCD screen and digitizer assembly to the front frame. With a triangle opening tool, work around the Droid Turbo 2 display slicing through the adhesive. Take your time and apply additional heat as needed. Once you've sliced through the adhesive, be mindful of the ribbon cable when decoupling the Droid Turbo 2 display assembly from the frame.
All the replacement parts and repair tools used in the video are available at www.fixeasy.com. Make sure to take a look at our other DIY smartphone and tablet repair tutorials. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, like us on Facebook, and follow us on Twitter.